There is no actual mirror tool in SketchUp. However, we can easily mirror objects using the Scale tool. It works like this. Select the object, then pick the Scale tool to activate the scaling grips around the object. The middle grips work best. You can see by grabbing a middle grip that you can stretch the object along that direction only. To mirror the object, simply squash the object until it reverses directions. As you pull it out again, watch the measurements box. When the scaling amount equals negative 1, you have a perfectly mirrored copy. If you prefer, you can start scaling the object, type negative 1, then press the Enter key to finish. All you need now is some practice. Try something like this. Start with one component, copy it several times in different directions, then mirror the copies in the appropriate direction. Just find and use the grip that is in line with the direction you need to mirror. There is no way to mirror and copy an object at the same time, so if you need a mirrored copy, make the copy first like we did here, then mirror it with the Scale tool. Keep in mind that there are modifier keys you can use with the Scale tool. A useful one here is the Control key, or Option key on a Mac. Hold this key down to scale or mirror the object from its center. Now that you understand the concept, here are some ideas for mirroring objects in SketchUp. Copy and mirror components to create anything symmetrical. This builds on the natural strength of components. You can take it a step further, select both components, copy and mirror them again for even more efficiency. You can also mirror simple shapes. This is great for creating complex symmetrical shapes. Just create one half or one corner of the shape, then copy and mirror the shape over and move it into place to finish the shape. Copy, mirror, and move shapes around as much as you need. Now that you understand mirroring, you won't be able to work without it.